300,000 people have signed up to storm Area 51 and see them aliens. Hi, I'm Jenny, and welcome to Gentle Corner. The Clinton administration couldn't get there. Russian spies tried and failed too. But that won't stop nearly 300,000 alien enthusiasts from gathering in Amargosa Valley, Nevada, with plans to invade top secret military base Area 51, where conspiracy theorists believe the government is hiding information on extraterrestrial life. Oh wow, aliens amongst us. The Roswell crash. All the goodness of a good old conspiracy theory. Oh, you've got to love it. The thought process that goes behind thinking that it's in any country's interest to hide a crashed spaceship from its people. The knowledge of other intelligent life out there in the universe when we have so ardently searched for it just, just is mind-boggling. And the fact that the original Roswell crash is so heavily debunked now. I mean, yes, there's an Area 51. There's a group right there. And yes, it's a military base. And yes, they tested aircraft out of it. But that's what the military does. They make things in secret and test them. Because they don't want other countries to know what they have. Especially when you're going back to the Cold War. But even now, it is very important that countries keep their military secrets secret. That's why they're secrets. So as soon as you have any organization wanting to be a secret, you're going to have the conspiracy nutters come out of the woodwork and go, oh, There must be aliens! Or, oh, the world is flat! You know, it's, it's just crazy. And the thought that these people actually think that storming a highly guarded military installation is a good idea. And there are signs around this installation saying, we will shoot on sight. That's not a good way to start your day. If we Naruto run, referring to the widely memed manga character, we can move faster than their bullets. Let's see them aliens. Now, this article does go on to say this call to action is satire. But the fact that 300,000 people have actually signed up for this thing, um, despite the fact that a large majority of them will be signing up for the joke, does beg questions about our society that at least a, a decent handful of those people are signing up because they think this is a good idea. That they actually think there's something to be gained from storming the fort. That they actually think running in unarmed against a heavily armed military site is a good idea. That these people are not worried about their safety and are so deluded by their idea that there are hidden aliens that they would risk their lives to do this just absolutely boggles my mind. The 12,950 square kilometer desert site has been in operation for more than 60 years and officially fronted as part of the Nevada Test and Training Range affiliated with the Niels Air Force Base in Las Vegas Valley. Though only recently did the government intelligence recognize Area 51's existence. If the Storm Area 51 caravan goes through with the stunt, they'll be met by gun-toting guards who have been cleared to stop any intruders at any cost, per the site's strongly worded signage, use of deadly force authorized. Now. My call out to anybody who is legitimately thinking of doing this is think again. Taking your life in your own hands 
by running into a military installation that's got signs up that warns you he'll get shot. You know, I wouldn't want that to be the epitaph on my grave. Think again, step back, have a hot cup of cocoa, and calm down a bit. If aliens were really here, we would know. The powers that be aren't trying to keep things from us. Not those things, anyway. There's way too many other things that they'd probably like to keep from us. There's no need for conspiracies when we actually have government secrets. You look too deep and then you do something stupid and you get hurt and you really got nobody but yourself to blame. So be careful out there. Don't do the stupid. If you must be stupid, please be careful. Wow, what am I saying? If you're being stupid, you're not being careful. So anyway, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe and like and all that wonderful stuff. And this has been Jen's Little Corner. I'm Jenny. And remember, don't choke on the selfie stick or that bullet.